Back at the Silver Creek Sportsplex with two of the Bay Area's best teams meeting in a non-league contest. The Bellarmine Bells are 13-2 overall with junior Will Wegner batting 484. Palo Alto is also having a fine season with Alec Holmstead hitting 590 with 23 hits already this season. The two teams meeting in the Cunningham Classic at Bellarmine this week. It's our second Togo's Monster Game and Robert was there. Both these teams, Bellarmine and Palo Alto, hit the ball very well. Both teams batting over 300 as a team. But those bats will be tested in this tournament game today. Kyle Dean, a right-hander going for the Bellarmine Bells. And for Palo Alto, it's junior right-hander Justin Hull. Both pitchers will be tested today. We'll see if it ends up as a pitcher's duel or if the hitters have their way in this week's Monster Game. Here's Kyle Dean for the Bells getting some fine defense behind him in the first with one on. It goes to Troy Berg, to Antonio Garcia, to John Helmers, a double play. Bottom one, and Justin Hull is looking good for the Vikings, getting the K here to end the first. The Bells have an outstanding third baseman, Nick Belafranto, charging in and making a fine throw here to first for the out. But Pally has skill at the corner as well. This is Max Jung Goldberg. My grandmother was a Goldberg. We have similar skills. I think we're related, making great plays like that. Hull helping himself here as he sees the runner at first and craftily picks off the runner for the out there. And now a runner on in the top of the fourth. Still no score as my cousin Jung Goldberg sends this one down the left field line to put runners at first and second. And then with Phil Lewis at third, it's Hull sending the fly ball deep enough to center to score Lewis from third, just safe at the plate, and it's a 1-0 lead for Pally. From there, more fine defense. This guy does this in his sleep, which really screws up the covers. Belafranto with another outstanding play there. The Bells get three hits. This the biggest of the three. It's a double down the left field line for John Helmers as the big first baseman slides into second base, but he does not score as Hull gets out of the inning and pitches a three-hit gem for the Vikings, striking out five as Pally wins it one nothing. A great day for Vikings junior pitcher. Justin Hull with five strikeouts and a three-hit shutout. It's, it's fantastic, you know, uh, just come out here, try to pitch the same every game, throw strikes, get ahead on hitters, and worked out well today. I think it really, it, it'll really give us a boost, um, help us out, keep this rolling, uh, do really well the rest of the year, hopefully.